outrage tonight after a Muskegon Orchard View field trip to Michigan's adventure ends with a boy left behind. 24 Hour News 8's Marley Ginter spoke with that student's father tonight. She joins us in studio. Marley? Well, Sue, he says he answered the most frustrating and frightening call from his son's school today, telling him they got back from a field trip and noticed his son was not on the bus. Then, he says, teachers told him he had to go get him. And then he went. Andy Nicholson sent his 13 year old son Ethan on a school field trip and regrets it. Especially when we didn't find him right away. <laughs> I was really upset. Ethan says a field trip to Michigan's Adventure in Muskegon started out fun but turned into a nightmare. I'm scared to go back to school because I don't know if the teachers will keep on watching me. And stuff. Ethan says one minute he was playing, the next minute he was alone. The bus had left without him. I had a feeling that, like, a feeling that it was past time and stuff. I went up there and asked what time it was, and they said it was 2 30, and I was like, uh oh, I missed my bus. Upset and scared. I didn't know what was going to happen to him. I didn't know once he found out his school left if he, if he was going to try to walk home or something like that. I didn't know. Nicholson says a teacher like, called him, I, said they'd left his son at Michigan's Adventure, and that he was going to have to go get him. We reached out to the school district after hours and didn't hear back. And then they leave and they say, well, they call me up, you got to come and get your kid. I mean, what is that? <laughs> Nicholson blames it on poor supervision and a lack of chaperones. I want them to uh, admit that they were in the wrong and that they weren't supervising the kids good enough. And not to, for this type of stuff not to happen in the future. Ethan is supposed to report to the principal's office tomorrow. We sent emails and left voicemail messages for the superintendent and the principal tonight. We'll let you know when we hear back. Brian.